Hello children. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to learn yes no questions. Before we move on to the lesson, if you have not yet subscribed my channel, don't forget to like, share and subscribe my channel. Let's get started. What are yes no questions? Yes, no questions are the questions that we can answer by saying yes or no. For example, is she an actress? No. Do you know English? Yes. Are you happy? Yes. To perform yes-no questions, we can use either auxiliary verbs or model verbs. Under auxiliary verbs, we will be discussing how to form yes-no questions with be, do, and have, and under model verbs, with can, may, will, and shall. When it comes to auxiliary verbs, we have three present forms of be. Am, is and are, and the past form of am, and is, is was. And the past form of are, is were. And there are two present forms of do. Do and does. And there is only one past form for both of this, and that is did. And there are two present forms of have. Have and has. And there is only one past form for both of this, had. There are a lot of model verbs. But we will discuss these model verbs. When it comes to am and was we use them for I. When it comes to is and was we use them for he, she, and it. That means for singular nouns. When it comes to our and, where we use them for you, we, and they. That means for plural nouns. And do, and did, we use them for I, you, we, and they. That means for plural nouns. And does, and did, we use them for he, she, and it. That means for singular nouns and have, and had, we use them for I, you, we, and they. That means for plural nouns. And has, and had, we use them for he, she, and it. That means for singular nouns. Okay kids, let's discuss how to perform yes, no questions with be. Okay, I will discuss this in two parts. First of all, we will see how we can form yes-no questions when B plays the role of the main verb. Example, I am happy, she is a doctor, they are from Sri Lanka, she was beautiful, we were friends. I am happy. Here I is the subject and am is the main verb. To form yes-no questions, we have to change the word order of the subject and the main verb. Am. I. Happy. First, the main verb, then the subject, and finally the rest of the sentence. Am I happy? How to answer this type of question? You can either say, yes, or yes, you are, or yes, you are happy. She is a doctor. 
he or she is the subject and is is the main verb. And to form yes no question, we have to change the word order of these two. Is she a doctor? First the main verb is, then the subject, she, and finally the rest of the sentence. How to answer this question? We can either say yes or yes, she is, or yes, she is a doctor. They are from Sri Lanka, here they is the subject, and are is the main verb. To form the question we have to change the word order of the subject and the main verb. Are they from Sri Lanka. First the main verb, then the subject and the rest of the sentence. How to answer this question? We can either say yes or yes. They are or yes. They are from Sri Lanka. She was beautiful. He or she is the subject and was is the main verb. To form the question we have to change the word order of the subject and the main verb. Was she beautiful? First the main verb, then the subject and the rest of the sentence. How we can answer this question? We can either say yes or yes. She was, or yes, she was beautiful. We were friends, here we is the subject, and were is the main verb. To form the question we have to change the word order of the subject and the main verb. Were. We. Friends. First the main verb, then the subject and the rest of the sentence. How we can answer this question? We can either say, no. Or no, we weren't. Or no, we weren't friends. Let's see how we can form yes, no questions, when B plays the role of an auxiliary verb. An auxiliary verb helps the main verb. These verbs are also called as helping verbs. The major uses of B as an auxiliary verb are to form continuous tenses and the passive. Example, I am preparing a cake. She is doing her homework. We were playing badminton. I am preparing a cake. Here I is the subject. Am is the helping verb. And preparing is the main verb. To form the question we have to change the word order of the subject and the helping verb. Am. I. Preparing. A cake. First the helping verb, then the subject, then the main verb, and the rest of the sentence. How we can answer this question? We can either say, no. Or no, she isn't. 
Or no, she isn't preparing a cake. She is doing her homework. He or she is the subject. Is is the helping verb. And doing is the main verb. To form the question we have to change the word order of the subject and the helping verb. Is she doing her homework? First the helping verb, then the subject, then the main verb, and the rest of the sentence. How we can answer this question? We can either say, yes, or yes, she is. Or yes, she is doing her homework. They are painting the walls. Here they is the subject. Are is the helping verb. And painting is the main verb. To form the question we have to change the word order of the subject and the helping verb. Are they painting the walls? First the helping verb, then the subject, then the main verb, and the rest of the sentence. How we can answer this question? We can either say, no, or no, they aren't. Or no, they aren't painting the walls. He was studying English, he or he is the subject. Was is the helping verb. And studying is the main verb. To form the question we have to change the word order of the subject and the helping verb. Was he studying English? First the helping verb, then the subject, then the main verb, and the rest of the sentence. How we can answer this question? We can either say, yes, or yes, he was. Or yes, he was studying English. We were playing badminton, here we, is the subject. Were is the helping verb. And playing is the main verb. To form the question we have to change the word order of the subject and the helping verb. Were. We. Playing. Badminton. First the helping verb, then the subject, then the main verb, and the rest of the sentence. How we can answer this question? We can either say, yes, or yes, we were. Or yes, we were playing badminton. Now it's your turn. Make the question for these statements. He is making a chair. Great. Is he making a chair? She was singing a song. Excellent. Was she singing a song? They were happy about it. You're doing well. Were they happy about it? 
We are students. Great. Are we students? They were doing the assignment. Excellent. Were they doing the assignment? Okay. Now we have come to the end of our lesson. From next video we will be discussing yes no questions with do. See you soon from next video. Stay tuned with my channel. Stay safe and happy. Don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel. Bye.